Hey everyone, it's me, Doomlink, and welcome back to Let's Play The Legend of Sparrow, Dawn of the Dragon. I don't know exactly what part it is right now, it's either 28 or 29, but it is the 23rd of May 2018. So many numbers that I'm throwing around here, but either way, this is the first time that I'm entering this little door. I have a lot of health crystals here. What was going on there? What's with the auto camera? So I go here, right? And it's like, oh, hold on, you need to look like, you need to look at the uh, environment in this way. We're going to move your camera like this. And I'm just thinking, can you stop? Like, I actually can't move my camera. I am forced to, oh, okay, so the door's closing. That's why it's making me look in that direction. Now I understand. Is there some weird ass sound going on? You have to understand that my sound is kind of low, so I can't really hear it, but either way. Let's pull this down, shall we? Spam X to pull down the lever. That is this game in a nutshell. Also, Cinder goes in by herself. Hold on, what? <laughs> I thought she had died for a second because she, like, did a mid-air backflip. I was thinking it was some kind of epic death. Now, speaking of epic, I'm getting rocks thrown at me by Grover, which is kind of epic. Not something you'd expect. Alright, so these stupid things are going to be returning and... Oh, this is not good at all, so... What I'm going to do... I'm trying to shoot my magic here. This is, I'm shooting fucking fear. This is not what I wanted. Please do this. Alright, now shoot the poison. And if I can destroy whatever that crystal is, is it still there? It's not affecting me anymore. Stop shooting that. So, I think as like... Oh, here we go. This is not what I wanted at all. Please go away. Ah, uh, there is a... Mm, losing my patience. Just do that. This is good damage, I think. Is it? I completely missed with that one. This is not good at all. I'm really trying to focus. Of course, for those of you who didn't see the previous video, these frickin' black crystals that bind you to one position are really annoying. And I want to scream. Because I have to uh, put up with them, but either way. I'd love to kill you without, like, expending all of my magic for no real purpose, because it's not actually helping me out at all. I may as well get this experience crystal just to kind of tide me over. But, um, let's, let's go over this way and <laughs> actually get some of our magic back because this is really stressing me out. Uh, it's stressing me out because I, I just feel like I'm not doing enough damage to these guys uh, versus my magic expenditure. So let's, uh, ma oh, maybe we'll keep away from these things. I don't know. It's probably safe over here, is it? I'm not sure. Let's, uh, let's get the boulder out, shall we? So if we uh, go up here, can you fucking stop? I want to scream. All right, so we'll, we'll drop the boulder down. I don't know if that... You need to actually hit them with it. How about we, we start... How, how do I do it? There we go. Whew, that's probably some good damage, I'd reckon. And seeing how he's floating in the fucking air, I hate it when they do that. Well, he died. That's one thing. I'm going to fucking fire at you. It's funny because it seems that that, that boulder charge, does it... It doesn't actually... Um, hold on. I need to use this camera. Of course, the camera controls are disgusting in this game. If you ever want to know what's disgusting in this game, it's the camera controls. I can't see where I'm going. Because the camera controls, I'm telling you, they, they do not do anything to help me. I don't know if I'm running... Yeah, I ran you over, successfully. Can you die, thank you. Stop floating in the air. Like, seriously. See how he dies anyway? It's like he has to float in the air before he dies, and it's very obnoxious. I'd love it if they just stopped doing that. To fucking launch into you. See, now he's probably floating in the air. I want to see if he... Hold on, no, he didn't float in the air. So maybe if they float in the air, it means that they're dying. I don't know. I don't know what it means. What does it mean? I don't know, but it's annoying. That's one thing that I can tell. Alright, can you just die, thank you. Once again, melee really doesn't feel like it does anything. Melee is the best way to get your uh, magic back if you can't actually find a crystal for it, but... So now that he's floating in the air, that means he's dead, is that right? No, it doesn't. So what the fuck does it mean? It just It's part of the combat. Basically, you send the enemies into the air and you hit them mid-air. It's kind of like a melee thing that you can do, but I don't do melee in this game because it sucks. Look, these guys are back. What joy. Basically, dropping the rock down on them probably does something, but probably less than launching the rock into them like that. So I'm going to shoot this poison. It's probably the best way to wear them down over time. I'm gonna do that. He just shields the whole thing, because he's an asshole. 
Alright, get me out of here. Um, I'm gonna go and get Cinder's health back up, because she is losing a bit of it. It would be very disconcerting to actually have to do all this all over again, after all this effort that I've gone to. Uh, yeah, can you die? Thank you, thank you. I can't see shit, honestly. Like, the combat's a bit dirty in this game in the way that you just can't see what the fuck is going on if you're trying to melee. It'd be great if these things could come back. Alright, so I guess I'm stuck with Spyro, because he has a lot more health and I really do, do not want to risk messing this up. See how I got bound to the ground all the way over there? It'd be great if it didn't do that, you know? <sighs> Magic, please. Or experience, you know, because I really need experience right now. Speaking of experience, I'm having quite an experience right now in terms of the gameplay, and it fucking sucks. I'd rather not have to experience it. Maybe I can just climb this thing and get the fuck out of here, because more enemies did spawn there, you know. So, come on, grab onto it, thank you. Maybe I just needed to get out of here. I don't know. At this stage, I really don't care. Just, just get me out of here. I want to progress, thanks. Look at these guys. Just stop, will you? Get more experience, I suppose. More health is not that needed for Sparrow, but is definitely needed for Cinder. Get it back, come on. And then I fall before I can collect it! Son of a dick! Oh, there's something about this game. Anyway, let's drop, thank you. Stop doing a barrel roll, will you? Yeah, do a, do a barrel roll! No! Stop it! Star Fox. This is not Star Fox. Anyway, of course, I said Star Fox as if Star Fox is a character. It's just Fox, I believe. Not Star Fox, but anyway. And who was doing the barrel roll? Well, Slippy was the one saying do a barrel roll, right? You have to understand, it's been several, several years since I last played Star Fox. I, I barely remember anything about it. Um, <laughs> and by several years, I mean more than several. But, um... Let's, uh, come on, hello? Please get the crystal. It just disappeared into the rock, I guess. Whatever. So we're making some sort of progress here, mainly because I'm not stuck in that first room still. I was expecting, you know, maybe a chest to appear if we killed all the enemies. I don't know. Basically, what this game is telling me is that I don't really need to focus on killing enemies. I just need to kind of get by. Maybe fight them if I feel like it, but just get by and continue through the game anyway. I don't really know what it wants me to do, but either way... We can get our magic back here. Uh, we want uh, Sparrow to do that, because he has no magic right now. Probably both crystals will be required for this. Come on. There we go. Hidden these crystals like I just don't care. And uh, health is not too bad right now, so we'll just keep it at that. Save our time and effort. I don't know where we've gone right now. I don't know if we want to go further down or further up or where the fuck, but we're going to have to go somewhere. Probably further up by the looks of it. So that was the room we were in before. We don't want to go there. We want to fucking avoid that like the plague. Because there's nothing over there as far as I can tell. Oh, there we go. There's more stuff up here, I guess. Be great if the wind could be of some level of assistance. I'm flying between the buildings now because I've got nothing else to do with my life. Alright, well. Here we are, I guess. What good fun. All I'm trying to do is go higher, but I, I can't figure out how to go higher. So what we're going to do is we're going to fly into this first room. Use the vines to help us out, I guess. Yeah, I'm getting... Uh, I guess pinned to the ground again. I couldn't think of the word. and It's not even pinned. I'm not happy with pinned either. My brain is on overload because this game is pissing me off. I'm telling you, this game didn't piss me off this much when I was playing it, like... However long ago it was when I was younger, but... It was in like 2009, 2010, but seriously, I want to go up there, but you see the fucking wind is just like, no, nope, sorry, sorry about that. You have to stay on this level, because, uh, yeah, just deal with it. Meanwhile, I want to scream. Okay, so just just to give you a fucking idea, I'll just... <sighs> okay, um, <laughs> let's just figure out what's going on here. So we'll, we'll do that again, and we'll see if there's any other way to get altitude before flying around. Fuck me. You think... That just happened! That just happened, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Spyro Dawn of the Dragon. <sighs> it's happening. It's happening right now. So I keep... Basically, I keep on getting um, stuck to the ground here by these things. Hit the fucking vines. Thank you. Hit the vines. Get off the vines. Go there. Thank you. Get out of my life. All right. 
So, I'm going to hit this, this thing. I'm going to see if there's anything that we can grab onto to get some altitude. So, I want to go to the higher level. Fuck off! I'm killing you, I'm killing you, I'm killing you. Get out, get out, get out. Of course, you remain. And I don't even know if I've done damage to you, because there's no means for me to see how well I'm doing. I really don't know. Like, it... Not that health bars are that common with games like these, it's just I feel like I'm so ineffectual. When I might actually be very ineff... Oh, I meant the opposite, very effectual. Effective! Effective, ineffectual. Not really effectual by itself, but... Please, just go there, whatever, I don't care. I just want you guys to die. I don't know why, but I just feel like killing you will achieve something. I don't know if it will. I really don't. But, you never know, really. You, you just never know. It's better than just bashing my head against this wall over here. Watch. Watch this. See that? Yeah, that's the current wall that I'm bashing my head against. I can't get up there. And there's no fucking reason why. It's just like, no. Sorry, you're not going up there. You want to, yeah. There's shit up there, yeah. But you're not. But you're not. See? So what does it want me to do? Kill all of these enemies? I did that before, but they came back. So what do you want from me, game? What do you want? I wish I... I wish I knew. But I don't. Stop it, please. I'm fucking begging you. Just stop. Save me from this hell. Okay, so, is there something over here? There's this. Yay, experience. This is exactly what I wanted. Die, thank you. So what we're going to do, maybe, is switch to ice. It seems to be the only thing that does any fucking damage. And you, I think you're shielding all of it anyway. Just stop it, please. Thank you, ice, for being the only thing that does anything. Okay, so, more health here, thank you. Don't fall down there, thank you, Cinder. Do that. Watch out! It's like, you know, it'd be great if you just shut up. Yeah, thanks. Alright, so... I don't know if I'm even doing anything. I, I must be doing something with this somersault. Yeah, are you dead? No, you're not. We'll come up here. Come on. Let's come up and have a fight, shall we? Are you travelling through the wall? Whatever. Let, let's not even question... Okay, am I making progress? I'm making progress, guys. So basically, I killed the first wave, and then the next wave appeared. But in actuality, there were two waves in total. I was just assuming that they were respawning enemies that I didn't need to focus on. whoop de fucking la de do suck my cock. So, here we go. Let, let's collect this health. Thank you. I need to really, I guess, uh, get my shit. He's coming after me over here. Was not expecting that one. So, I need to go down here, collect... All the magic I can collect. I don't know if I want to be uh, Cinder or Spyro for this. I need to be both because they both will be doing damage. But uh, I guess for Spyro I'll pull out my ice because why not? And for Cinder, uh, her poison. So I just need Cinder's magic. Here we go. This is what I like. This is what I like to see. So some respawn, some don't, obviously. The ones in the very first room there do not respawn. Wish I knew why. See, the one's just over here. Come on, wind. Alright, so... These two here do not respawn, and I don't know why. I don't know why. So, anyway. Fuck off. Thank you. Thank you. Fuck off. Where are you, Grover? Where are you? Yeah, okay, so basically I can destroy these, can't I? Stop it. Hallelujah. So, just, just break, please. There we go. Should have done this from the start. I was a bit stressed and unfocused. Either way, so that's just very important for this confrontation. We have a huge uh, confrontation area. I'm not going to use my Fury Meter on this guy, because you never know, there might be something worse that's hanging around. You missed me, asshole. So what we're going to do is, first and foremost, uh, do some poison flips. So we're going to poison you a little bit. I don't know if you get affected by it or what. Seems like you're affected by it. Poison flip. Poison flip. Starting to run out of magic, but we can do it again. Poison flip. No idea if I'm doing anything. 
And that's that's all for me, I guess, with Cinder. And that's all of her magic spent. Now we're going to move to Spyro, who will... I don't know. I don't know what he's going to do. I don't know if it's better for me to shoot the Ice Crystals or what. Let's just try that out, shall we? I don't know if that's doing anything. You look very stylish with the Ice Crystals, mate. It doesn't really consume any of my uh, magic at all, so it probably sucks, but... Uh, Let's, let's pull this out and go really, really fast with him. Did I kill you? Fuck yeah. Alright, so I had a feeling that I'd continue through that hole. I just had a look about it. But yeah, so that, that worked out very well. Of course, I'm very happy that I didn't waste my fury meter there. I did make the right decision there. So uh, that is always encouraging. I'm going to get some more experience, because why not? Uh, let's check the experience. So who has more? Oh, I can't tell from here. Let's uh, let's check uh, elements, I guess. So you have six, eight, five hundred, and you have. Oh, wait, no, I'm I'm looking at the wrong fucking thing. I'm looking. I'm actually looking at the wrong thing. So you have sixty-two thousand. You ha hold on. You have seventy-three thousand. So we will use Spyro for now. I was actually using. Uh, sorry, when I was referring to that number before, I was actually looking at the um. What? Why is that on the screen? Why is that on the screen? Did you guys see that? Anyway, that was very strange. I was looking at the wrong number, long story short. And it doesn't really matter anymore. So what we're going to do... <laughs> let's not dwell on these issues, shall we? Going to get Cinder's magic up. Wouldn't mind a save point. Wouldn't mind a save point. And uh, what about Spyro? Okay, we are going to be using Spyro from now on, because he needs a little bit more experience. And here we go. Do we have the altitude that we want? No, we don't. No, we don't. Let's try again. What's down there? Oh, you. No. No. Optional mini boss alert. Optional mini boss alert. Get out of my fucking face. So, you never know. Maybe one of these mini bosses will be required one day. This might be one of those. I'd rather if it weren't the case. Do I want to continue straight through there? Is that what I want? Yeah, I do. Okay. I don't give a shit about that higher level. I really couldn't care less at this stage. A little bit more experience for me, but I can live without it. Why are you flapping your wings, Cinder? I don't need to, so maybe you should stop. Yes, I do want to save the game. Reached Malifor's lair. Well, holy shit, you'd be... You'd think we were pretty close to the end. We're about... Well, we were at 83 out of 100 before. Well, I may as well just say 83%. But, um... Yeah... You can see Malifor's fucking evil face there. <sighs> Cutscene time. Are you ready for this? No. I'm scared. <laughs> Just stay close to me. See how I'm like completely emotionless and saying I'm scared. Like I can really feel the scared you are. What? Are you Malifor? I didn't realize we were that close to the end. Nothing like you. Well, Spyro, you're gonna look like that in the future. Listen to him, Spyro. Don't listen to anything he says. Oh, well, now you're fucked. Oh no, his words. They're going to corrupt me again. You were my dragon, sex slave, and you still are. You're lying. <laughs> that fucking face of Sparrows, that was great. Nice teeth. Is it true? No. Why did he have those know. straight teeth? You should have like fanged teeth like Spyro does. But look look at his teeth. Did they just choose not to draw them properly? And just do like a a straight line for his teeth. Look at his teeth! Dragon teeth should not look like that. Cinder, no! Well, we've seen this before. I can't get over his teeth. Why do they look like that? 
They did Spyro's teeth properly. Look at that. See, Spyro's are fine. Feels like I'm playing a visual novel and I just got a bad ending. The bad ending being that guy's fucking teeth. Look at them! I'm... Oh my god. And now you don't have teeth. What is going on in this game? Look at his teeth! Look at them! It's creepy how you looked like you had arms there, but like, more human than dragon arms. <laughs> oh. Yeah, you see, Malifor gets it. You just do it again. Do it again. <laughs> because you've left me nothing to fight for. Oh, that freed me. That one sentence freed me. There's always something. Uh, yeah, okay. We'll, we'll go with that, sure. Okay. That works. Now I'm gonna help you out again. By <laughs> connecting you together so you can swing around and actually complete these areas. <laughs> Fucking Malifor. So do we fight Malifor? I don't know what we're doing, guys. I'm so confused. I don't know what to do. Help. <laughs> I guess I just get close to him and, like, do things. I don't know. What should I be doing? Uh, ice. I get oh. oh, that's good. This is exactly what I wanted, so my fucking Xbox controller, I have to tell you, is actually really fucked up right now. It, um... You would think it had just run out of batteries, but like... Or batteries, sorry. you think it had just run out of, um... There we go. Now it's connecting again. It's so fucking retarded. Anyway, so I'm glad it pauses the game for me when I do that. That hurt. Um, so... I'm gonna... Ooh, hold on. So, let's try and do the whirlwind. I'm really not getting much of an opportunity to do this. Um, please stop fucking Jesus! I'm not getting a chance to do anything. I really don't know, like, what I should be doing. I think I should just be, um, evading like that. So, I'm at least going to try and poison you. That, that's one thing that I can fucking do at this stage. I think attacking him will get my health up, is that right? Seems like it. So he... He's already lost a bit of health now that I'm looking. Please stop. Oh, I'm about to fucking die. Where are you? Get over here, thank you. I'm basically ev evading around the place. Please do that attack. Please do that attack. This feels like it's not being responsive at all. It's because I keep on, um... Auto-flying to keep my altitude. Fucking auto-flying. I'd love that health back, by the way. That health was kind of cool. Now I'm dying. I'm dying. Right, let, let's let's fly. Come on. Yeah. Fuck yeah. Woohoo. Now, flip, please. Flip, flip. Alright. Sparrow's turn. Health back, please. Health, please. Health, please. <laughs> Alright, I got, I got some back. There we go. Alright. Quick. I don't know if I'm actually doing anything now. It didn't look like it, did it? Ouch. This hurts. I'm getting my magic back at least, but I'd like to have my health back. Oh, they're both literally about to die. Alright. Sparrow got some of his health back there. I'm pretty much just doing the, um, the ice... This is probably the jankiest boss fight I've ever fucking experienced in a 3D game. I have to tell you. So I got some st shit back again there. Woohoo! This probably looks really weird for you guys. It, it feels fucking weird for me, and I'm the one contr- Whoa, that was crazy. I'm basically auto-flying around the place here. Now is our chance! <laughs> oh, I, but shit, I pressed the wrong thing. Now I'm fucked. Alright, now we have to do it again, because I pressed the wrong button. I was, like, getting excited. I thought I was finally done. <laughs> I'm excited for the end of this. Let's go, come on. So, um, need to, uh, there we go. Come on, come on. Speed up, speed up, speed up, speed up. This is what we want. Now's our chance. Alright, so A button first. A. Need to actually pay attention to what I need to press. X. Just A and X and we beat Malifor. Woo!
<laughs> Probably not. No, he's still going. Oh, it has begun. Okay, now now the real fight begins, guys. It's this guy again. Oh, that, that was very well-timed subtitling there. Oh, okay. We'll just go with that. Yeah. Yeah. But do you realise just how much distance that is? Like, you see, whenever they show a distant shot of the Earth with something going on that these guys are a part of, like, you, you don't realise how much fucking bigger it is as you're showing it on the Earth's surface, compared to how it is here. It's just so funny. Anyway, uh, I guess we're fighting Malifor still. I'm about to fucking die. I'm about to fucking die. Well, what do you want me to do? I, I don't know what you want me to do. That that entire thing was just nothing. And there was nothing going on there. I guess we get taken back to the start of this fight. That works out. I am cool with that. So, are we playing a Spyro? Yes, we are. For now, I'm going to... I, why am I... should be in ice. That's what I want. So, I don't know if I'm hitting you right now. No, I'm not, by the looks of it. Malifor's just fucking doing crazy stuff. Uh, do I have crystals here, or do I have to hit you still? I think, I think I still have to hit you. So, we'll switch to Cinder. I will go ahead and poison him. I reckon poisoning him, realistically, if doing damage to him gets my health back, then poisoning him would be a great idea, because that's like constantly hitting him. So we'll do that, and I'm going to do some poison flips. Alrighty, so I got some health back, but... I should be using Fury Meter, but I... I can't even remember how to do it, to be honest. I, I've only done it, like, once ever in, in this playthrough, so... Getting my health back, which is always good. Just poison at this stage. I used Spyro the first time, now I'm using Cinder. It works out nicely, so poison flip. Thank you. Poison flip. Poison flip. I'm largely off target, but who cares? I can't poison flip anymore. Come on. Alright, switching to Spyro. Oh, oh, hello. That scares me. I don't want to get hit by that. The camera is doing its own thing at this stage. I don't understand what it wants. Did I get health back? Uh, sort of, but not really. That looks like it would hurt. <laughs> what if it gives me lots of experience? Have all these experience crystals. Spyro. I don't know what killed me, but something killed me. Because I don't know what's going on in this fight. Long story short, I don't know what's going on in this fight. But anyway. Here we go again. Does it uh, reset his health here? Okay. We'll switch to Cinder. I'm going to just shoot my poison to start with. Oh, and she's immediately dead. I guess we do need to sort of watch for where we are positioned in relation to Malifor. You have to understand that I'm really not taking this fight very seriously. It's a bit all over the place, but... Because, um, you know, we're both flying and mid-air combat feels a bit weird. And anyway, um, I'll lead. Yeah, do that. Do that, my dear. Do that. So, I'm going to poison and then poison flip. Poison flip, please, poison flip. Because it's doing auto-flying, it, it it sort of interrupts whenever I want to do the uh, the poison shit. Alright, switch to Spyro, thank you. Um, wrong shit, I need the ice, thank you. Oh, oh, and I accidentally switched to Cinder, who died. Okay, um, I pressed the wrong thing and I switched dragons. And uh, Is this really exciting for you guys? <laughs> Ugh, it's not exciting for me. Long story short. So, so, ice please, and we're going to ice whirlwind whenever we can. Ice whirlwind. Probably just stick with ice for now. I have a feeling it's a bit more consistent. It just seems a bit more consistent to me. See, look at this. Look at that. It's just better to go with. It's like, I'm actually beating the shit out of him right now. Yep, ice is the way to go, as I suspected. So pretty much how I do it is I press uh, RB... Well, I hold RB and I spam X and it just speeds up really hard and beats the shit out of him. Check that out. Ooh, hey. Oof. This is where the real combat is, guys, and his teeth are still fucking awful. Watch out. Thanks for that. X. Y. Well, that's, that's exciting. Of course, if we fuck this up, then we have to do the awful confrontation again. Well, we did it correctly. It's just now we've moved to the next level of confrontation, I guess. Can you handle us, mate? 
We have ice element. Did I fuck it up? I must have fucked it up. I don't know how I did that. Hey. Watch out! Did I spam A too many times? Or Y? Or do I still need to spam Y? Is that how that works? What? Do I need to keep spamming Y even when it leaves the screen? I must. It's very fucking confusing. Long story short. Just die, thanks. Die, thanks. Die, thanks. Alright. So here we go again. A. And then... X, is it? A. Watch out! This is so fun. X. And then... Here we go. So as long as we continue to spam it after it's left the screen, we're fine. You know, you keep it on the fucking screen so that you don't confuse me, game. Thank you. Because if it leaves the screen, it makes me think, well, if I keep pressing this, then I'll accidentally press a different thing. Alright, here we go. Now we're at the next fight. Whoa! I'm not going near that shit. That looks very painful. Maybe we need to go close to it. Alright, I'm gonna give it a shot. I feel like we're attacking his barrier and then it'll break or something. I don't know. It doesn't seem to be working. Um, ouch. That's not really working out too well. Uh, ladies, first. ladies first? But Spyro was attacking first. What are you talking about? I guess she means I'll lead ladies first. Haha. <laughs> but, um... This isn't working, there must be something we need to destroy in the area. What what might that be? Is there anything? I don't know. He's got this force field around him now. Like, what do we do? Do we wait for it to... disappear? Ooh, that, that looks like it'll hurt. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. that's... that's scaring me. No, really, this is bothering me. I don't know... What does it want from me? I can't hit through it. Or can I? Am I doing damage? I don't believe I am. I'm charging- I didn't even know that I could charge up the poison shots. How about that? It is now, during the final fight, that I learned that I can do that. It's, it's not working. I- What's happening? Now- now something's happening. What- What is this? What even is this? I don't know what's going on, but whatever. This is fucking... This is just... This is crazy. Guys, this was a PS2 game. Can you believe this? I can't. It's, it was pretty good for PS2. I'm going to put it out there. Am I doing anything of worth right now? I don't know. I'm almost out of magic. That's one thing that I can tell you. I'm charging up this thing, and it seems to be doing something. Are we falling endlessly until we reach a, a damage threshold, or what? I don't know how it works, to be honest with you. I haven't done this fight for so long. I don't even remember this fight, even. Have we dealt damage to him in this time? I can't remember what his original health looked like. I'm trying to evade through this. And I seem to be doing a reasonably good job at it. I'm not using the Fury Meter still, because, I mean, I, I don't know. I don't know why I'm not. Oh, yeah, it's because I can't remember how. <laughs> I think I need to press... Uh, I don't know what I need to press, to be honest. Can I... Uh, options, does it show me controls? Uh, tutorial is on. Moves, here we go. Uh, <laughs> in the air. X, 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 X. <laughs> nice. That's... Uh, what a combo. Um... Alright, so these are all very interesting. Did I see snake skill? Dodge move. I don't know what the fuck is even going on. A seize your opponent. Yeah, I mean, Terrador's sentence. Seizing an enemy. Shake enemy on the ground several times before crushing him on the ground. Okay. Well, that's like a... Anyway, this is not helping me out. I don't even know how to, how to do any of this. Um... Let, let's just, let's keep fighting, I guess. I'm taking you guys out of the, the out of the moment, you know. But, uh, anyway, let, let's... Oh, I think I have a... Th I have a, uh, an armor piece on Cinder that actually regenerates her magic, which is good to know. That is very good to know. I am sticking with Spyro because Cinder is looking really poor with her health right now. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing as it stands here. 
but uh, I, I don't know what else I could be doing, so I'm just going to continue meleeing his little force field. Because uh, I have made some sort of progress by doing that. He's, he's had the force field up this whole time. It's just that I'm a little concerned that I'm not getting my health back. At least I don't think I am. Oh, that's... Ooh. That's actually tailing me quite a bit. At least those attacks are. Uh-oh. I'm scared of that. I'm, I'm just evading around the place, and I hope I'm actually doing something here. I'd love to get my health back. Because <laughs> before I was hitting him and I was getting my health back, but now I, it feels like I'm not successfully hitting him. And it kind of sucks a little bit. Here we go. So we're going to attack him again with our magic, because that does damage him. Uh, but this is, yeah, this is definitely dire. Oh, there we go. Got some health back. That's happy, happy days. Now I feel like I'm not actually going to fail and have to do this shit again, while also being confused as to whether or not I'm actually doing damage. Which I think I am. It looks like the health bar has grown smaller, but I'm just very worried because I'm not getting my health back enough. You know, this... I can't see what the fuck is going on right now. I, I'm just... Oh, I, I really don't want to die. Maybe I should pull out the Fury Meter if I can, is it? I'm trying to press random shit now. Oh, it is, it is X and Y, ladies and gentlemen. Alright, I am... I, that is killing him. That, that is doing a thing. That is killing him. I hope I didn't just waste it, that's all. Please tell me you're fucking dead. Oh, I need to spam X, apparently. Here we go. Maybe the key is to use the Fury Meter, I don't know. Is he fucking dead? If not, then did I waste my Fury Meter? I should have saved it for this time. I don't know yet. It kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Jesus! Uh, you should kind of have your fucking arms ripped off right now. Oh, press the wrong fucking thing. Here we go again! Now I fucking ruined it. What do I do? Do I... Oh, no. Oh, we're doing this again. Son of a bitch. This is not what I wanted at all. So maybe what we'll just do is we'll fucking Fury Meter. I don't have the patience for this, man. What? What is it? Is it... What's Fury Meter? I fucking succeeded in doing it before. Here we go. I think it's... I don't know what it is. I really don't know. But I'm just gonna... Yeah, that just... That destroys his health. Check his health going down. That's so good. Yeah, get fucked, mate. Get fucked. Now that's just, that's a really good time to save the Fury Meter, because he takes close to no damage with his force field up. So that really works. So we need to press X again here. X. I really don't mind if the process of killing him is conducted during cutscenes like these, like interactive cutscenes. But I need to watch for what I need to press. It's A, I believe. Why? Rawr! Destroy Malifor. <laughs> the, the game, the game spoiled it by uh, giving me the achievement. Never mind. You cannot defeat me. I am eternal. Well, apparently I've already killed you according to this achievement, so I know what happens. Just hang on. I know what happens because the achievement was given to me. <laughs> Ouch. What if he was like a turtle and he couldn't get back up? Oh, hello. What is this? I don't know, man. I wish I could tell you. I don't know what's going on in this game, to be honest. One thing that I can tell you is that I felt kind of emotional after, like, when I originally played this game and I finished it, I felt a bit emotional, because, you know, I've always been a bit of an emotional person when it comes to something ending, and this game gave me that feeling, it'd be interesting to see if I, if I feel the same way. Probably not. I think because I enjoyed my original playthrough a lot more than this one. I know what I need to do. Just get out of here, Cinder. Spyro, no. 
You don't have to do anything. Let's just go. Where, Cinder? There'll be nothing left. The world is breaking apart. But I think I can stop it. I think I'm meant to. Then I'm with you. I love you. Oh, I love you. There you go. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. And the Earth reforms itself, because why the hell not? You know, why the hell not? So next you're going to tell me that all the things that originally lived on the Earth that were fucking obliterated because the Earth was obliterated are all alive now, yeah. That's how that works. And that was the most emotive I had ever seen the cheater guy ever. His name's Hunter, that's right. Is that the moon? It's fucking big. It shouldn't be that fucking big, man. That thing's gonna slam into you. Oh, that's a dragon in the sky. What is that? Is it Spyro? Is it Malifor? Who is it? Malifor's blasting off again! That, that's, um, yeah. Well, that's the game. Um, I don't know if there's more after this. In ter well, not in terms of, like, games in the series, but, uh, in terms of. I, I guess story content for this game, like if there's going to be something after the uh, credits. I don't know if I can skip them or not, but I'll take this time at the very least to thank you all for watching this Let's Play. Um, I guess I I sound like I'm so enthused, or, or at the very least, no, humoured is what I'm thinking of. I sound so humoured because I, I didn't realise when I was sitting down to play this today that I'd be finishing the fucking game. I thought I still had more to go. But it seems that last 20% was going to be over very fucking quickly. I just didn't realise. So, um... Yeah, toward the end of it, I really didn't... I guess that explains why I didn't really remember too much after that lava place where I was uh, destroying the crystals, because that was, like, one of the later things that I'd remembered in the game. As I was continuing on toward the end there, I couldn't really remember what was going on. Like, I, I had no recollection of doing that. And the reason why was because... It was so close to the end, like there really wasn't that much more to go. So, yeah, that's probably why I couldn't remember anything beyond that point, because there were no other areas to visit. But, um, yeah, the game is alright, it, it's fun enough, but uh, for whatever reason I had more fun playing it on the Wii. I don't know if the controls were more intuitive on the Wii, it would be very strange if they were. I played it with the Wiimote and the Nunchuck, for God's sake, so you'd think it, they, they were pretty bad controls, but... I don't know, but uh, all I can tell you is that I had more fun with the game uh, several years ago, how, how long ago was it, eight, nine years ago, um, than I did this time, and keeping in mind of course that this was the first time that I played the game since playing it back then. So I don't know if I have changed, or if it's different on the Xbox 360, I think there's probably a higher chance that I have changed, like I have a higher standard of quality when it comes to games now, which is not only connected to the fact that I've played more games since then, but it's probably also connected to the fact that I'm older now and I, I have a, a more sensible outlook, I think. Or at least a better sense of what's good. Because, of course, when you're a kid, as you know, I mean, I wasn't that young back then, but I was younger. And when you're a kid, you just have a lower standard of entertainment, I have to say. So, yeah. I suppose my standard of entertainment has risen since then, in these eight or nine years, so that's good to know. Uh, I'm going to see if I can skip the credits. Uh, I, yeah. Yeah, I'll save the game, why not? Let's go ahead and do that. And yes, there is more, I guess. What? Welcome, friend. Aren't you from the very first game? I've been expecting you. A new age is beginning. With each new age, a worthy dragon is chosen to chronicle the many triumphs and failures of that age. This has been my duty for many years. I don't know why Sparks is there, but whatever. And now, he doesn't actually do anything. I pass this honor to you. 
What else do I know? Is he? Hmm. That is the question, isn't it? What is the question? See, Don't you know? Each time a dragon dies, a new page is written I guess Spyro sacrificed himself, and Cinder did as well, I don't know. I can't seem to find any trace of Spyro. That's all for me, have fun figuring that out, man. Oh, now you're blue? Well, young dragon, where might you be? Yeah, that's nice. That's a nice ending. I'm a very sentimental person, you'll have to excuse me. But anyway. No, that was nice. Um, story mode over. <laughs> um, what that means is that I guess I, I can't continue defaultly with whatever the story is, but I can choose a chapter and go and take that on if I want to. But of course, uh, it seems that I completed the Malifor's lair area. Don't know how. Floating Islands was not... Oh. I guess Malifor's lair was just that boss fight. That's a good point. So, okay, I got all of the destroyer stuff. I'm just checking what I've missed. I've missed plenty of things. Um, but, you know, it is what it is. I'm not doing 100% of this game, unfortunately. Replay a level in character mode. You won't be able to save your progress. However, level bonuses and upgrades can be saved. At the end of a level, or the level, a screen will sum up your progress in the level. Okay, that's good to know. I tried to return, but it... Okay, return. Thank... Thank... Returning... I don't know. I'm... Pr I'm pressing A, that's why. I'm fucking stupid. I thought I was pressing B. It's because I'm so used to playing on the DS. You'll have to excuse me, because, of course, the A and the B buttons positions are flipped on the DS. Why are you playing the DS? Because I've been playing Generations lately. I thought I was pressing B. I'm sorry. I didn't want to do this. All right. That's... That's it. All right. <laughs> that's the game, everyone. I hope you all enjoyed. I am quite happy to be done with that. I have to mention, of course, that I did start the uh, the Let's Play in, I think it was June 2016, so it has almost been two years, or maybe it was July. I think I started in either June or July of 2016, so it's been almost two years that this Let's Play has been going on for. If you, if you have actually been watching this since part one and have just gotten to the end of it, I do thank you for watching. I'm very appreciative of that. Uh, at times I did get a little annoyed with the game, but, you know, for the most part it was a good Let's Play. I Once again, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you in whatever game I happen to play next. I do plan to Let's Play pretty much all the Spyro stuff at some point on this channel. It's not really high on my priority list, but I will be doing it at some point. But, uh, yeah, seriously, thank you for sticking with me until the end, if you have done that. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in whatever Let's Play you happen to watch of mine next time. Bye-bye.